Hi, I'm Mike. And I'm Terry. We are full-time treasure hunters and resellers. We work hard. And we play hard. We travel the Northwest buying storage units as well as scouring the United States for liquidation merchandise. Our 20 years of experience has created a passion for reselling and has allowed us to spend time with our family and enjoy recreational and travel around the world. We believe laughter is the medicine of life and we are here to share it with you. Please join us on this journey and keep laughing with Mike and Terry's Retail. Hey guys, Mike and Terry here, back with you again today for another gigantic pallet, you guys. This thing is massive. It is it's a like, very big pallet. I'm thinking, this is like <laughs> you over six feet long. And about five feet tall, I mean, this thing is gigantic, guys. So welcome back to our channel. Glad you're here to see this. I don't know what all's here, but Terry told me there is at least one massive boom item on this There one. is a boom item on there. Huge and boom. And all I will say is it is that one item is over $500. Ooh, I'll, I will let that part out. Oh, man. That, that, it, so, it might pay for the whole pallet, guys. It might. So let's keep our fingers crossed that that yes. comes in perfect. So that? let me tell you what we got here while Mike's getting man. this cut open. I'm going to start well, peeking. You, you, <laughs> yeah, you peeker. So <laughs> oh, I see you. I see you. So all in. Ooh. Look at that. All in. $437. Retails. Three, we paid, sorry. All in, we paid. Mike, you have me so distracted. What did I do? Ooh. Okay, scratch it. <laughs> okay. I scratched it. <laughs> Bleep. Okay, here we go. All in, we paid $437 for this pallet. Retails $3,188. There's 10 items right there, which is going to break it down to $43.70 for this pallet per item. All right, guys. Whew. Man, 40 good thing you didn't talk on. again because I would have messed that all up again. <laughs> We're looking for $44 an item, guys. Here we go. $44 an item. I feel like that was like some song, you know. Start with this. Oh, I know what song it is. I guess we shouldn't be singing it right now. Ta -da! Oh. Ta -da! What do we got? What do we got? Well, we got a box. It says, with, oh, Wisteria Lane. It's crazy. Ooh, Wisteria careful. Lane. Careful cutting it You open. know about Wisteria Lane, right? I do. Really? Do you really? Be very careful cutting that. But do you seriously know about Wisteria Lane? Are you Lane? listening to me? No. It probably says don't use this. No, I can see something in there, and I'm afraid that we, if we cut it, we'll ruin it. We will not ruin it. Okay. I'm a highly trained professional yeah. here. <laughs> I've seen you in action. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. It might already be ruined. Dun, dun, dun. Kind of looking like used bedding, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> the dun does. Sniff it. You sniff it. I don't smell anything stinky. All right, let's so see what, what we got. Yeah. What it looks like this, guys. What brand is it? I don't know. It doesn't feel expensive. It looks real Is nice. it UGG? It smells like, I smell that chemical smell. No, it's ink and ivy. Okay, ink and ivy. Here's the shams. I mean, these look like they're still factory folded. So, ink and ivy... And the size is 88 by 92. So, do you remember what size that is, Mike? 88 by 92. Probably a queen. Um, you know what, guys? I normally wouldn't do that, but when we're you putting can it, smell that you can smell the brand new fabric. Um, can you imagine what this costs to ship? No. We actually sold that, um, what was it called? The New Orleans Saints bedding. On eBay, I shipped it out today. I only sold it for seventy dollars, and the size of box that perfectly fit that bedding set was going to cost fifty-six dollars to ship it to Missouri or wherever it was going. So I ended up finding a smaller box, and I packed 
that thing in there, you guys, and uh, brought the shipping down to like 26 bucks. But this, this from Oregon would cost a fortune. From Oregon? <laughs> from Oregon? I bet you that would cost uh, I $75 think. to ship. Why is this just, it is just fighting me right now. No luck, huh? I'm just trying to find the size. I think that's a full, oh. full queen. I guess is what I'm looking at. We could probably just look right here where it says. 88 by 92 is a queen. It says full queen right here. Three piece comforter set. <laughs> You're always wanting to scan. How come you didn't scan it? Because it's been got you covered. a long All right. day. $140 at Bed Bath & Beyond. In fact, you know what? I'm going to screenshot that for you guys so you know what it looks like. So is this what it's like when we reverse it? Would you say it's a log, Dave, because I drive you crazy? Yep. So <laughs> All right, guys. How much was it, Mike? 140 140 I believe it's well, brand new, probably $40. I'm thinking out of package. Yeah. $40. At best, best case scenario there. Okay, best Mike, case scenario. We gotta, we gotta pick it up a little. Right. Man, those those booms on there better be a boom. This one's gonna be a boom right here as long as it's not damaged. Let's see what we got this, here. This boom item, guys. We're at forty-four well, bucks. This tonight. is fun. Humble crew, humble crew. How is that possible? Is it really that small of a box? Or is it all interesting? Not here. No. It's, it's, put it together is what it is. You haven't told them what it is. I'm getting ready to. It is a kids book rack storage bookshelf. It's not worth a lot of money. Walmart, $25.78. So there's the size and where's the cloth? That's what we got, guys. And to hey, top it off. Guess what? They're damaged. And there's no rails. So there's 44 bucks right down we did get the hardware. <laughs> well, shit. Okay, negative 44. Negative. Mike, you're not allowed to touch merchandise no more. All right, let me see. You pulled, you pulled out a comforter that has been open and a book thing that is not complete. You bought so, this. You bought it. If I pull it off, it's going to have good mojo and will be brand new. It's going to change inside the it box, does. right? It does. All right, guys. So she says this is going to be... But you didn't let me pull that one oh, off. Oh, go ahead. No, you cursed it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, see? You completely cursed it. You hear that rattles? Here's what we got, guys. What is, what is falling out of that? I'm wondering if it's the little beads out of the moisture packs. What did you do? Did you just get yourself? Hmm. What in the world? Okay, they are beads. It says it's... <laughs> wow. <laughs> let's set it on the ground. You let's guys can see the picture. Let's set it down and let's, let's open this. It says that it's Salem Blue. It's Salem something. Here, you open your side. So I think those little beads are out of those little moisture absorbing Oh my gosh. Wow. That looks awesome. Okay, let's open it all the way up. We gotta make sure it's not damaged because it has been unwrapped. Well, there's one moisture pack and that would be beads. So I completely agree with you on the beads part. Oh boy. No, we are not having, we are not opening the beads and having a hail storm in here. No, we do not sna do We do snail. <laughs> we do snowstorms, but not the hail storm. All right, ready? Um, Take it down to the table. This is nice, you guys. <laughs> Don't wait. What are you you're, doing? You're pulling it from my hands. Ta-da! <sighs> no legs, guys. This is a short person's chair. You have got to be kidding me. Where is the legs? There they are. They're in there, guys. <laughs> let's, so, see what the, let's see what the legs look like, though. I think they're still factory wrapped. Where's the zipper? Not on my side. I'm trying to find it. There's no zipper. You can never get to the legs. The legs are impossible and to get to. And you can see it's tufted on the back. 
Let's see. It's pretty weird, guys. There's no zipper. I'm telling you, it's legless. All right, we're gonna have to look into that further. The legs are in there, and I can feel the like the bubble wrap. I feel like they're they're wrapped in there and brand new. I can't yeah. seem to see the the zipper pull to open it. Here is the screenshot for you. Black le excuse me, black legs, Mike. Two hundred and forty-five dollars. Boom. Hundred bucks. Okay. I don't feel like we can go any higher than that. Armchairs are kind of hard to sell. Set it up here. Look out! Look out! It's getting dangerous in All here right. today. So, what are we gonna sell this for? Hundred bucks. Hundred bucks. I got beads everywhere. This is it's a mess. <laughs> you guys can't see them. They're like almost impossible to see. But it is kind of a mess. Ooh. I have no clue. I do. It says it's a king headboard. Watch out. I'm going to be in your audience today. Okay. Let's see how well Mike can do. All you right. could use that blue chair Ta -da! as like a king's chair up there, Mike. Okay, guys, I'm going to get you a screenshot first so you know what you're looking at. And so I know what I'm looking at. Did you miss me? I did. Wow. This is unbelievable, guys. $451. For one headboard? For one <laughs> For so, one headboard. What we got to do. Not even a footboard, just the headboard. <laughs> we need to find out if this is new and undamaged. That's a lot of money. For one headboard. Well, I believe that was factory sealed. And this is factory wrapped. And what is their reasoning? There is some kind of, I got it, a frame. Product damage, send replacement. I don't like the sound ah. of that. So it's not like they changed their mind and returned it. There was a reason that they saw. Please be a very small reason. You want to pull it out? Yeah, I do. If I could get, I don't know if I can. You might have to it's reach all the way under it. Ready? That was not my fault. Look at that, you guys. It's like a padded, tufted linen. I don't see a damage yet, do you? No, it could be to the frame. Put you want to set it, it off to the side? You got me twisted up like a pretzel now. Okay. I don't see it, yeah. Let's move it over here. Okay, we're going to move it off to the side. Just so we can check that out more for our, all of you to see. Go ahead, I'm going to look this up a little more. Okay, let's check the framework. I mean, because they never opened this part up. Okay, so, they did open. No, they didn't. They did. So what is damaged? They're damaged. What? This is weird. So we're going to check. I mean, the hardware is all completely intact in here. Hmm. But it does look like maybe they opened the... That's interesting. The framework. I mean, they're both, both the uprights for the headboard are in here. They don't appear to be chipped or broken or anything. It's starting to make you wonder if it really was damaged. But they asked for a replacement. That's what's even more weird. Right, because normally if, they, maybe, if it wasn't. Oh, maybe there really was not a problem. But they wanted to go about that whole song and dance so they could try to get like half credited back to them. You know what I mean? For the inconvenience and the mm. hassle. I don't know, guys. I don't know. I have no idea. I can't so, find anything wrong with it. Okay, so we're going to say that it's undamaged, brand new. What can you sell that for? Well, did you screenshot? Yeah. 450 250 250 without blinking an eye. It's gray, wow. it's light gray, it's king, which is the most desirable air. 250. To desirable okay. one, at least in our area, but I believe a lot of places, most people like a king if possible. 
All right, and, guys. Yeah, two fifty. Okay, I'm, oh, I'm fifty. Not gonna lie, I am skeptical, but I, I, I hope we can. About. That's a lot of money for a hit board. But I just that's feel, not our boom item. I feel skeptical. I know it's not. This is. I don't think that's a lot of money for a headboard. Should we go to a furniture store and let you look around for a while? You'll get scared. You, you would say, honey, please, when you find it in our job, buy it. If we need it, just buy it because you don't want to go probably pay retail, right? It'll be a long day, guys. <laughs> Furniture store has financing. We don't have financing at Mike and Terry's retail. Yeah, but you're still going to pay triple the amount. All right, what do you got? You saw that bead go in the air. Sandy, Sandy Forest. Sandy. Sandy Okay, Forest. where's the barcode? That's the color. Well, probably one of these. I don't think so. Probably that top one, I think. I don't think so. You might be able to find a bit another bead. beyond one. How come there's beads all over this, even? Because you dumped them all over the pallet, remember? No. I guess you forgot about that part. All right. Ooh, what is it? Wow. Oh. Screenshot. So what is this retail, sir? Artwork, $77. Hey, you haven't sold your last artwork yet. No. You haven't even posted it yet. Um, I posted it a long time ago. That artwork right there? No, you were posting that, not me. I thought you were talking about the three oh. panel one we got. All right, guys, let's, let's see. see what do we got. Are Here. they? They're new. The cardboards are oh, all on the size. corners. They're factory packed. There is no box damage. Any box damage anywhere? Not that you can tell. No, a little bit on down there. They got corner That's protectors, it. so it should be okay on the bottom. Um, it should be all right. I'm gonna still say this is new and this is fine. And what do you got? How much did it retail? $77. $35? Sound good? Worth a shot. $35. Yeah, Not $350, only $35. Bring on the boom. We're doing that one? Well, oh, it's boy. on top of it. Okay, hold else. on. Is there a scan right here? Yes, before we set it down. All right, guys. Before we put it down there. Safavia. Oh, here we go with that word again. Safavia. 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 Get him a screenshot. Well, first, I gotta work? pull up Safavia. I got one right here. If that one doesn't work. Um, partially worked. Let me see. I got it. I thought, what color is this supposed to be? Gray. It says. Oh. I thought it was supposed to be black. But hey, I'll take gray. Uh, compare from five stores. Nobody right off that. I would say yes, that's, you know. So the first one, English Elm. $644. It's a love seat, by the way, guys. For this. They already saw it in the screenshot now. But you didn't tell them the screenshot. screenshot. Product damage, send replacement. I think it's the same people. <gasps> gray and gray. Let's see. see. This one definitely has been unpacked, though. Is that one didn't. Name? I don't know, is it? I don't know. I didn't look at the name. You got me wondering. I can't really. It does have some, like, some little scuffs on top. Oh, my gosh. I, these people bought it to go in their bedroom, this whole set. Go check the name. I need to know the name. All right, guys. Where's the papers? Right there. That's for the headboard? We, it's for both. We can't tell for sure. It really does look brand new. But until we actually pull it out of the box and completely inspect it, we'll never know. Is it the same people? It is not the same people. I didn't think so. That would, wouldn't that, that be crazy? Been, that would but they're exactly like the same gray color. So I thought maybe it was. Nope, one is from Minnesota and the other one is from Pennsylvania. Okay. So, all right, guys. Oh, hey. Wow. Guess what? Let's I get think. A better screenshot. I think what? tomorrow is Fun Friday. <laughs> oh boy, guys, Fun I Friday. Like fun Friday.
That was a good hit. What are we? Don't run me over. We're good. Oh. Open it. You were picking. I thought you were opening it back uh, up. What? Will it just slide right there? No, because we still got all these. Under there. It won't fit under there. Provided that it's not damaged. Correct. We're going to have to pull that one all the way out. Correct. If it is, we'll adjust depending on how big the damn more beads. <clears throat> you are a dangerous man today. This one is gigantic, but it is Ooh, not heavy at it. all, you guys. Go ahead. I got a coat. Uh, this could be anything. Right it could be anything that's not very heavy. You know what this Probably you know what this could be? Probably another piece of artwork or something here. No, you know what this is? Oh, no. This I is, do know what this is. This is 10 <clears throat> saltwater fishing rods in here. I know what this is, you guys. And how about some screenshots? Well, how Let's about we just take it out first. and show them? They don't need to see screens. We're going to show them the real product today. Real product, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. You guys have seen us get these before. Please don't be broken. Please don't be broken. Everyone, oh. everyone has. This one doesn't seem like it is. <laughs> Ready? The suction. Ta da! Flip it. This is a lumber. Console table, you guys, it is not broken. <clears throat> How is that possible? It's beyond me. Every one of these we've gotten has been broken. Some of you guys have even made comments that you have gotten them also. So, so it uh, retails uh, at all stores except for one, uh -huh. $125. Isn't that something? Yeah. The other store is over 200 Guess what? But think about the price of lumber right now. The price of lumber right now, guys, is through the roof. I mean, if you're not aware, at least here, one sheet of plywood is almost $100 now. That is absolutely crazy. So this, my friend, must, just lumber alone must be $75 here. <laughs> so what do you think? 40 bucks. Oh, you are going to sell this so fast. We'll try for more, but... I'm going to put at least 45. It 45. seriously looks like a homemade piece of furniture. But you're going to have the screenshot showing it's not. I know. And it's going to have that rustic, and it's wood, and it's... Yep. Okay. Ready? No. What are you doing? Oh, you're just taking the box? Yes. Yeah, this is another huge box in our way. So, I say 45 dollars. All right, she and raised me five dollars, guys. <laughs> okay, we got just what, three left. Fun Friday. Wow, they're just getting bigger, aren't they? They are, except for that one. What is Save this? that one for the end because at least it won't. This is massive. It won't kill us there. Mattress used. Oh, this is a crib. It's, no, it says toddler bed. Oh, a toddler bed. Oh. Okay. How come I can't get it to go over here? <laughs> Thank you. All right, it appears to be brand new because Ooh. the back is um, has straps. This one strap that but this is, I was dragging with right here. Yeah. There's strap, 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 and strap, and these are all taped shut. I believe it's new. The question is, does it have any corner damage or anything concealed in there? That will be. Toddler bed, huh? All right. Show me the money. Nope, not on that one. Let's Not try on that this one, one. What? Not that scan. What about it? But on this scan, but it doesn't say toddler bed. It does say crib. Okay. Well, where did What's you get toddler brand? bed from? It says right crib must be used at least 27. It's a crib. Where did I see toddler bed? I don't know. This is probably lifetime crib. This is probably one of those ones that you can convert <clears throat> to a toddler bed, and you probably saw it on there somewhere. Probably. So let's compare to five stores. 
um, we'll just go to Bye Bye Baby, Bed Bath & Beyond. They're both the same price. White Crib, $255. Hold on a second. I don't know what you're going to say. I need to back up a minute. Oh, no. Hold this. Oh, no. i got to go over here to the couch. Oh, no. Boom! I forgot to boom it, you guys. I'm off my game today. <laughs> oh, man. Guess what? What? Boom! Cribs we normally sell for ninety to a hundred. It de it almost doesn't even matter what they yeah. retail. We just can never seem to get more than a hundred dollars out of them. There, how to get you guys a good screenshot all there? Right. And how I didn't want one with pop-ups coming up all over the screen. Two hundred and fifty-five dollars. Do you think we can pull out one and a quarter? I'm gonna try, but if honestly, it's brand new, undamaged, of course. I will try, but honestly, I don't feel that it'll happen. But we will try. I don't know. We just did our garage sale this weekend. One day garage sale we had. There was three pregnant women there. At one time. It was nuts. I Crazy. looked over and I'm all belly, baby belly, another baby belly. There's baby bellies everywhere. I'm gonna try. <laughs> I like how you say I'm gonna try, but it won't be I'm gonna try. Because I'm your numbers person. I already told you I would try what. What are you doing? I'm getting out of your cage because you're a scary person. <laughs> okay, let's see what this, this one is. Oh my lord. It's another, right. another really big heavy one, Mike. Okay, how you doing? You need my help? No. You're always telling me you want to work on your halibut muscles. But I'm in flip-flops and I don't want to smash my toes. Because it's hot outside get today. Out get out of here. What do you now got? I gotta edit that part out of the video so OSHA doesn't find out. <laughs> Have you guys that. ever heard of anybody working in a warehouse in flip flops? And I have. And yes, I have smashed her toes a few times. Okay, what is this one? And I still have stayed. Another with you. crib! Yes! Just what you wanted. That's this not is, factory packed. This one probably will be no good, guys. Well, let's at least see what we got. Okay. We got. Go ahead. All right. You party on. We got. We got party nothing. on for what? It says it's a Nolan four-in-one crib, white. Um. They didn't. You didn't oh, get all the numbers. I don't know. You could just hear it rattling. There we go. Let's see. Oh, it, did, it worked that time. Is it uh, Carter's? Nolan. Carter's Nolan. There yep. it is. Okay. It is $220. I will still screenshot it. I'll show you guys what it looks like. What does it look like? You showed them. With the screenshot. That's yes. what I was saying. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So, I, I'm going to tell you guys a little something about cribs. And some of you guys that are full-time resellers, you've probably been down this road many times just like we have. Cribs, if they are not new, if they have any scrapes, chips, deep scratches, anything, they don't sell. Nobody will buy them. Um, and if there's anything even comes close to being broken on them, you can't even get anybody to buy them for repurposing. I mean, I've tried to give them away for free, and nobody will take them. Mm -mm. So I know a lot of you guys have made comments in the past saying, you know, offer it up. Somebody might want to repurpose it for a, I would love know, a for project or whatever. And we have tried and tried, and the reality of it is we wind up taking it to the dump. Well, because you can't donate them. You cannot donate them. Because of them. safety reasons. Um, so just, there's just yeah, nothing we sad. can do with it. It's them. actually really sad that we can't, you know, you think somebody would at least do it for some form of a repurposed project and you can't get rid of them. Make a, make a rose trellis out of it. Or, Anything, or, right? Or something. Okay, what are we finding here? Well, we're finding something that's kind of heavy. And I was just going to say, I've, I have realized it's heavy. Let me tell you what we got here. I love these, these printed out stickers that they plop on them. Okay. Wow. Well, Let's see. I like what it says it is. If that... Well, there's your, your screenshot.
I'm going to take it out. If it's new, $230, Mike. Okay. I still don't know quite what it is. It just says chest on there. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Okay. It's been open. It's been open. Well, let's just take it out. Okay, go ahead. I'll hold the box. I have a feeling it might be damaged. Oh, it might be, Man, it might be too heavy. There's nowhere to grab. Oh, boy. Okay, I got to get in a different position here. Can we just pull this one out first? We can. <laughs> hold on. Ready? Oh boy. So all, all the knobs are protruding. Okay. I'm not sure how to go about this. Sorry about that. Ready? Yep. Ah. <coughs> all right. Let's see. Oh, we're done. No more box. <laughs> I tried to get so it out of here. Okay, guys. So it's a little six. I'm assuming it has legs inside. One I of can these hear drawers. them. Yes. There's all so the we legs. Have legs in there. The drawers. They don't slide. They're a little well. stiff. Huh? Well, it's a design. It's just it's all wood. It doesn't have any runners. So this is a cool. It's like a almost like a little nightstand. Mm-hmm. So what do we have for a price on it, though? You didn't tell me. Oh, 230 I said. Oh, it is. It scratched on top. That's why somebody sent it back. You know, I know it's... But that's minor. It's not a deep scratch either. It's, it's like literally a, like a, a a rubbing surface scratch. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. I couldn't tip it much more than that. We were going to have a problem. So... Okay, so how much... It's not that... It's 230 What were you, you going to put it up for? I know. I'm going to try for 75. Kay. This is not going to be an easy mover. No, it's, it's a not. cool design, but it's small, limited uses for this. Um, you know, it's not a dresser. It's not like you're going to put all your jeans or anything in here. It's almost like an oversized nightstand. But it is cool. Good color. Let's see what we got here. Yeah, I'm, I'm excited to hear. We have a couple, couple downfalls, but overall couple, we came but... out with some good items. So yes. All right, here we go. Okay. Ten items. Ten. And items. then we have one that was well the the book thing, the little bookshelf thing that was a no good. No so go. we're down to nine items. And some of the other ones are like maybes. We're not maybes, but, we know, but oh, the comforter. We know we got nine items that we're probably going to be posting. So, I'm still going to give this a boom. Okay, no, it's a baby boom. Boom. <laughs> you can do a poof with it. A poof. Poof. All right. So, <laughs> do it. What do we got? All in, $437. Posting nine items, potential sales, $970. Wow. For a potential profit of $533. That is a hair oh, more than a double up. Eight items. Why? Because I am almost positive this crib is going to be no-go. Oh, no -go. that's right. And I didn't eight put any numbers here. down for yeah. the crib, that crib because I figured it was a no-go. If we can so salvage anything items. out of that crib, it will be probably no more than 40 bucks. So Eight items. Boom! Ah! <laughs> Stop it! Man! Ah, okay. All right, guys. Hey, real fast. If any of you have not heard that on the 12th, which is up there, is that, yeah. So the 12th here, NCL is putting out a hey, new. This video is already coming out. So what came out on the 12th Bust my was Wednesday. Oh, you're right. You're right. <laughs> anyway, tell them about it. So. NCL is putting out a brand a new cruise ship that you will be able to book for and I don't work for them But I was excited because we're going to try to be booking on their new ship So anybody who is curious wants to jump on board. I get it jump on board <laughs> What's the name of the ship Mike called the Norwegian Prima Prima 
It'll be a brand new Ooh. ship, and they will start taking bookings on the 12th. The 12th, which yes. Which was yesterday. For next for summer's next summer sailing. Correct. Correct. So, FYI, if none of you knew about that, that do cruise, I know that there are a lot of cruise, cruisers out there that watch us and they are itching to go because you have messaged us and talked to us about it some. So, there's just a little heads up for any of you that were not aware yet of it. So, okay. Now we can finish it. All right, guys. Thanks for hanging in there. Definitely have no a matter great what you day. Do, keep laughing today and come back tomorrow for Fun Friday. Fun Friday. Take care, everybody. Bye. Bye-bye.